all right big vibe so this is my third grill that I bought but I actually own a thousand dollar grill that's still in the box but I bought this one at Home Depot for $70 just to make this video shit's crazy over here but anyway more light it up then I'm all work on a vibe I'm gonna make a jerk tea marinade and I'm gonna marinate some pogies in there I'm gonna grill them on fire but first thing you want to do is you want to light up your grill get it started okay. so I got this uh, Western fire starter I've never used one of these before I wanted to get wood chip but they didn't have wood chip so you gotta take this place it in the center you probably can break it so this you gotta they say you just light it That's a kind of make me feel like grass mocha. Yeah, so now it's good. Big five. <laughs> hey, sometimes people have things that think it's a bit But then, anyway, now it's, yeah, so this thing, you get this thing going, and then you put it in there, you add your coal, and then you let your coal burn for a minute, and then you know the vibe. Big vibe, as always. So, if you're first time here hit that red subscribe button because we bring five and you know hit that like button thousand likes for this video and uh all right so let's do this i'm gonna put my all right so never clean your grill that's the vibe as soon as you're gonna use it that's when you clean <laughs> that's why i buy them so often it's funny but anyway so today we're cooking on fire big vibe so you know the vibe always I won't even say it big vibe so jerk tea you probably never heard of this before this is probably the first time anyone has ever made a jerk tea all this is is stick around to the end of the video so you know what it is we're making jerk tea so in my bowl cup of water some thyme, scotch bonnet, some ginger, throw it in there, a little Mexicano, jalapeno, and throw that in there, and some scallion. Do it the Jamaican way. You take a knife and you hit it. Bing, bing, bing. bing. That's so how you make the jerk tea. And don't forget, the Jamaican independence is coming up. So, big up Jamaica and the independence. Big vibe. All right. Key vibe. Some lime. Just like that. And we should put the rind in there. But I don't like to put the rind in there. So, I just put just the lemon, lime. Not lemon. That's the lime. This is the lime. And what the lime do is it just break down the fish and it gives it that vibe. Some watered down crazy chef jerk spice. Throw that in there. And we do it like that. So I want it to be hotter, so we're gonna add some abanara because I want it to be hot. So abanara in. And we're just gonna do that some salt and we're not measuring we just vibe this is just me vibe into the thing this key vibe you can't get this anywhere you can't get this anywhere key vibe some pimento throw that in there as i said I'm not i'm not measuring it so whatever you can judge me. Some paprika for color. Garlic powder. You know me, I like to put a little powder seasoning. Don't judge me. We're cooking fish, but we're adding some chicken spice. 
Don't judge me, it's gonna be good. Some soya sauce. Don't put too much because you just put salt. Put that in there. Some extra virgin olive oil for a vibe. Put a bunch in there. Just like that. Here we go. Some ground ginger. So we did put fresh ginger. Now we're putting ground ginger. So you know it's a vibe. Just like that. To the side. That crazy chef infused garlic thyme oil. Very good. Bunch of it in there. All right. Last but not least, what the girls like, some of that brown sugar. And we'll put like a couple tablespoons. So, I know I said last but not least, but a little bit of old day, some southern vibe. We we'll put that in there. Take your hands and just rub all that in. Just, just get that vibe, man. Take that, you take that scotch bonnet. That's why you use your hands, is you take that scotch bonnet and you just rub that spice all of it. And that's why you use your hands. So, next thing you wanna do is you wanna clean up your work here and I'm gonna show you that vibe. So, let's, let me show you that next vibe, the second vibe, that big vibe. All right, so, this is fresh pogi. Really, really fresh. This is like off the boat fresh. See how nice and shiny that is? So, to know if your fish is scaled right, it's like just rub the other way. Against, like you're rubbing against the grain and all you'll feel is that nice skin. And you'll know your fish is clean, right? Like the inside, you check the head and that's how you know that your fish is nice and clean. If you look at the eyes, you'll know like how fresh this fish is. So we're gonna take these bad boys and we're just gonna put them in the marinade, just like that. We'll just sink them in the marinade. And we leave these in here for a couple hours and just let them vibe. And this is our jerk tea. All this is, is a jerk brine. You've never seen this before. This is like a jerk brine. This is, you know, jerk sauce done right. That's what that is. Jerk sauce done right. This is my jerk brine. So you leave this for a couple hours. And you notice we didn't go snapper on this one we went pogi because we want the freshest of the fresh that's why we make the jerk brine and after you leave this for a couple hours it's beautiful just beautiful so we're gonna let this sit and uh after two hours we're gonna throw it on our grill and we're just gonna vibe so as always if it's your first time here hit that red subscribe button. And uh, if you support the vibe, hit that like button. Big vibe. All right, so big vibe. Coal is all lit, grill is fiery hot. Right now it's uh, 375 so I'm gonna throw my fish on get ready it's well marinated can't get better than this so check it you know the vibe big big vibe what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lever my coal out a little bit just to get a vibe and then I'm gonna throw my fish on because it's gonna be delicious Fish right on there. 
As I said, we're cooking with flame. So I'm going to drop him right on it. Just for a while. This is our jerk jerk tea marinated pogi. Cooked on raw flame. Raw flame. Big vibe. It's gonna be so delicious. Look at that. Raw flame. Doesn't get better than that. Doesn't get any better than that so. Mother's let them vibe again and then we're gonna put a little sauce on them and we're just gonna kill that vibe so you know the vibe big vibe so this is the vibe that we always been waiting for this is the vibe so let's go big vibe that's beautiful that is beautiful that is delicious look at it perfect let me let me get one off for you so we can check the vibe look at that. that's the vibe you've been waiting for all your life and as crazy chef would say big vibe big big vibe <laughs> 